10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, No Way Jose. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications. That way you get notified every time I post a new video. As you can see by the title, this is my coming out. I can't believe I'm saying that. Um, I've been wanting to do this for years. That's pretty much what I can say. I'm happy, I'm proud, happy with how life is going. I'm the happiest I've ever been, and I am... Uh, I just keep on saying the word happy, but I am really, really, really happy. And it, for most of my life, it wasn't like that, so I'm happy. And yeah, I'm happy that I'm happy. <laughs> but it wasn't always like that. I wasn't always proud. I wasn't always happy. The truth is that... Let me try not to cry. But November of 2018... November 2018, I was at a point where um, I hated who I was. I didn't want to be this way, you know? And I made the decision. I made the decision to end it. And I spent hours with a knife to my wrist. And to this day, this haunts me. Because you, if you guys know, one of my closest friends passed away from suicide. And it haunts me because I almost put my family and friends, those who love me, through that. And I know if Maria would have known how much we were hurting, she wouldn't have done that because she would never want to hurt anybody. So the fact that I almost did that, it haunts me. And I really, really hated myself. I didn't, I was not, I didn't want to be that way. I always questioned myself, why, why? And that wasn't the first time either. I began to get curious when I was like in my junior year in high school and I was just like why why one day after work I was just over it and I just couldn't I was like I always thought it was just a phase but it was going on for months and I was like I got home from work and I started taking pills I started taking pills like little by little little by little and my stomach started hurting so much I was throwing up throwing up all night and I was like, I really almost did that. I really almost did that. And I don't want anybody to be, feel bad or, or like, be scared that I'm gonna do that again because I would never do that. Like, the fact that I even tried haunts me because I wouldn't want to put my family or friends in that situation. But, I, I am very happy right now and I am proud that I'm finally doing this. I'm finally doing this. I am so happy right now. And by the time this video is up, I already told my mom. I already posted it on Instagram. I had a photo shoot the other day. I actually had to refilm this because I lost the footage. But I had a photo shoot the other day. And yeah, it's the, what I'm going to post on Instagram. So make sure to go check that out. I also do plan on filming the reactions. You know, like when I call my mom, I'm going to film that. When I text other people about it, because I want to tell some people before I post, because I feel like, I don't know, some people should know before everybody else, you know? And also I'll add in the video reactions of like, my friends who've been knowing for years, my sister who has been knowing for years, 
because for a long time I felt the reason why I'm putting it out there is because for a long time I felt alone. I know I had friends and family who loved me, but I felt like I was in this situation by myself, but there's so many other people who feel the same way that I, with the things that I was going through, people everywhere feel that way. So I want to put it out there and maybe this will make it easier for someone to come out. Maybe this will help someone who wanted to end their life because of the way they are, the person who they are. Maybe that would help them. If, if that would help them, that would mean everything to me because when I was in that situation, I really needed something like this and I hope this helps people. And I know this is gonna help me a lot. Like, I'm already so happy right now and when I'm out, I feel like it's gonna help me reach my ultimate happiness. So I really hope you guys accept me for who I am. But at this point, whoever doesn't, I'm okay with that. I'm happy. I'm happy with the people that I have around me with everything. So it is what it is. But if you do support me, I really, really appreciate that. So I'm going to be leaving a few numbers and stuff like that for people who need to reach out for help because that's what I should have done instead of the things that I tried to do, you know? So I'm going to leave that at the end of the video. Stay tuned for the next video. I'm actually pretty excited for this. I'm so ready. The only reason I, why I haven't done this before is because I really wanted to capture this moment. So I wanted those professional pictures taken for my coming out. So I'm just waiting right now for those pictures to be edited. I already took them. Like I said, I filmed this before. I actually was crying so much the last time I filmed it. But I lost the footage. And this time it seems a little bit easier to say it because I'm just redoing it, you know? Eh. I kind of wish you guys saw that one because I said everything like straight up, like no, nothing planned. And this time I'm, I kind of remember what I said last time. So it's kind of easier to say, but just know that I was crying so much. But you know what? I'm just really excited. This is finally happening. And this brings me to the end of this video. So make sure to comment down below your support. If you need help with anything, DM me. I don't know, I can help with whatever I can help, you know? And I hope this video helps people too. And make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on your post notifications. And follow me on my social medias. That'll be NoWayJose.98 on my Instagram, which the post should be up by now, and my Snapchat. That's it, peace out.